Patrick Maroon. All right, best place to eat in St. Louis? Oh, Charlie Gito's. Downtown. <laughs> Downtown Charlie Gito's? I don't know, he hasn't taken me. <laughs> What's your favorite flavor of ice cream? Mint chocolate chip. Oh, same, same. Yeah? Same, same. Game seven. Goal goes in. First thought that came to your mind? Uh, what I was thinking on my celebration was, I was when I scored, I thought about it, and then I just started skating because I was just in shock that I just scored one of the biggest goals of my career. So, yeah, I wasn't really thinking. I was just doing it. Yeah. I've never scored a game seven goal. <laughs> what's the most recent movie you've seen? Uh, what's that new one that just came out? It's um, long. Irishman. Yeah, Irishman. Irishman. I saw the Aaron Hernandez thing. Oh, that's not a movie. It's like two days though. It's a documentary. Two show? I saw that. If you were a salad, what kind of dressing would you have? Caesar. Blue cheese. Ew, disgusting. <laughs> what is your favorite cuss word? Are you like, uh, <laughs> 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 all your thing, bro. Uh, have you ever been to the top of the arch? Yes. No. It's too, like, small. Like, I feel like it's, how'd you fit that thing? I was young. I was like, maybe like. But like, would you go now, now, like, and get in that little car? Like, does like fit like like it's as big as this, right? You're like. Uh, does it just still go back and forth like that? When I'm, you're not going. I'm not going. I'm not going. You're on death row. What would your last meal be? That's tough. I mean, we talked. I just had this conversation with someone. It would either be like a fast food joint, but I would just go for straight ribeye, potatoes. You know, just mops, meat, potatoes. Yeah. Describe yourself in three words. Uh, passionate, lovable, uh, kind hearted. I'm going to describe you in three words. Oh. I think that you're very caring. Caring. I very caring. Caring's a good one. I guess I, I missed out on that. I think you're very loyal. Loyal's a good one. And I think that you are one of the nicest men I've ever met. You, didn't, you left out handsome. Because you can't just be on handsome. <laughs> If you had to watch one reality show for the rest of your life, which one would it be? Vanderpump Rules. I was going to go to that bar. Who are Caesars. What's yours? I don't watch reality TV unless it's Blues or Tampa or Buffalo. <laughs> <laughs> um, you, like, nailed it. I, like, nailed it. Yeah. You ever watch that on Netflix where they uh, they make the cake and it's like, they it's have to terrible. copy the cake and it's, like, terrible? No. Oh, oh, I nailed it on Netflix. Funny. Right, funny. Okay. Who was your first celebrity crush? My first. This is going to sound weird, but Cassidy Pope, country singer. No one probably knows who she is. They don't know who mine are, is it? Mine's Salma Hayek. Oh, yeah. You know, she's. Yeah, 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 she's oh. yeah it's good. What's the last thing you do before you step out on the iceberg game? I don't, yeah, do, some weird I don't, have, where you're like, I don't have any superstitions in my thing, I just step on the ice. Literally, I don't think about it. I just, you know, just handshakes, pound the guys, and go out there. But I don't have any weirdness. Weirdness like half that NHL does. Yeah. It's complete weirdness. Yeah. But that's how that NHL is. And you know, people think they play better if they have that in their game. Yeah, they tape their stick a certain yeah. way or whatever. I mean, so is every is every fight in the NHL kind of fixed? Like you know, you're gonna fight this dude because he wants to fight you, or is it more like? You have to stick up for someone, and so it just becomes a thing. No, I would say like if you're trying to get the team going, or you're looking for looking for yourself to get going, I think that's where the fighting comes in. Yeah. So like if you're down one nothing or two nothing, I guess you try to go fight someone. Someone slams against yeah. them. Yeah. Or you just try to ask the guy to fight. But now in the NHL, there's no tough guys, and it's hard to find. I mean, it's different. Reeves is well. You the Reeves, guy. Chara, those guys are just not. They don't have the money. I would say Luch and Reeves would be the best fight in NHL to watch. Yeah. And I, I don't think they'll fight each other. Because both of them were scared of each other. I don't know. I think it would just surprise them. <laughs> yeah, exactly. They should just do it to see who's the toughest guy in They NHL. should. I think they should put that in the All-Star weekend, like have boxing matches. <laughs> like Center ice? Center ice. Let's go. Boxing gloves. Real gloves, right?